Hey friends, I'm going to show you guys how to make some money on Swagbucks. Uh, it's a site that I use all the time and I'm going to start to do a little demonstration of how you make some money on there, things like that. Okay, first of all, I posted my link in the description underneath the video on YouTube. So I would really appreciate it if you guys, if you are not signed up for Swagbucks, please check out the description. And right here you'll see the link. And you're gonna click on that to join Swagbucks. Now here kind of shows my profile. Um, you're going to be signing up right here and basically you're going to enter your own information in there. As you can see, you're going to get a $10 bonus for joining. Um, one thing that's kind of cool about Swagbucks, I'm going to show you another page. Basically, anybody you invite you're gonna earn 10% of what they earn on Swagbucks for the rest of your life. So after you join, definitely invite as many friends as you can. One really good way to make a lot of money on the site. So I'm gonna go back to this page. Of course, you'd enter your own information here. Right now, I'm just gonna log in since I'm already a member, so. Right here, we're just gonna click login. Of course, you would have put your own information in there. Now, from what you can see, um, I've been on this site a while. I've earned some money on here. What you need to understand about Swagbucks, the most simple way to put it is, it is, Swagbucks are the same as money. You'll see, in my account right now, I have 338 SB or swag bucks. That's what I've earned in my lifetime. Um, each swag book equals a penny. And as we go through this process, you'll learn how you can cash out this for actual money or gift cards, whatever you want to do. So one of the biggest things I'm going to show you is this is my favorite way to make money on the site. So what I'm going to do is this is going to be my first, this should be your first step after you sign up. So we're going to come over here and I'm going to type, they have Swagbucks has their own. Once you're logged into the site, you have your own search bar. It works the same as, um, it works off of Yahoo's search. So, it already came up a little bit. What I'm searching for is swag button. Swag button. That's the first thing you're going to want to put in. So I only put in two letters. And since I did a previous search for it, it pops up. You can type out the whole thing. Swag button. All one word. Not two separate words. So you're going to click on that. Now you'll see right here. Get the swag button. You're going to click on that. Come over here, click on here. It'll tell you add the swag button. You're going to add it. Basically, it's a browser extension. And it was as simple as that. You can go through a little tutorial on how to use it. Now you got the swag button. It's right in my Firefox browser now. So this is a great way to make money. So I'm going to close out a couple of these tabs.
I'm going to click allow this extension to run in private windows. It's important to be able to use it properly. So now you're going to see this is actually right in, built into Firefox, the swag button. Have to zoom in on that a little bit. So this is how it works. I'm going to open up a new tab. I'm actually going to go, go to Google. And I'm just doing a regular Google search. I'm going to go to Priceline. It's my favorite site. To search for hotels. I'm just going to give you an example of how the swag button works. So now I'm going to I'm going to click on Priceline. I want to get a hotel in let's just say Now here's here's what you need to it's very simple. Swag button will actually pop up over here and you're going to see get up to 3% back on anything on Priceline, a hotel, a flight, whatever you want. So you're, you're just going to click on get up to 3% back. It pops up for you. The swag button automatically does that for you. It'll tell you 3% cash back activated. I go down here. Let's just say I'm going to, doesn't matter, Laguna Beach. Eh, let's say Vegas. Search for a hotel in Las Vegas. I mean, you know how to use Priceline. Basically, you're going to search, find your hotel, book it all on Priceline, and this 3% back is going to get automatically added to your swag buck bonus. Um, that's how the browser extension works. You go to... You go to Priceline to book a hotel. You can go to, you know, uh, Walmart.com, order something from Walmart, go to Amazon. Anywhere you go, this little browser extension, which is automatically built into your browser from now on, it's going to give you cash back on anything you buy at any site. Uh, I shop a lot on Amazon. I told you, you know, uh, Priceline's my favorite hotel booking site. Um, but... It will literally work on, you're going to get cash back everywhere you shop from now on. Um, you know, Swagbucks is a site that saves you money. You're not going to be spending money on the site. Any Anything you do, uh, you know, you're going to be, it's a site to save you money. You don't need to spend any money um, on Swag to get some money back with Swagbucks. But anyways, I just wanted to give you one example. It does. It works on every major site. I book all my hotels, I get cash back anytime I book a hotel. Money I wouldn't get back otherwise. So that's a pretty good example of how you can make some money. So like I said, um, you know, now I have the swag button installed. And now I'm going to go, I'm just going to click on swag bucks, which will kind of take me to the main page. So I'm going to show you some other ways to make money on the site. Some of my favorite ways. Um, huge way I like to make money. I'm going to give you my second favorite. Well, first of all, let me show you, let me show you how the rewards work. So obviously you want to be earning money. Um, I'll show you how you can actually cash out on swag bucks. That's obviously you wouldn't be here unless you're trying to make some money with the site. So you're just going to kind of hover over your balance here. I got 338 swag bucks. Um, I'm going to hover over my balance. I'm going to go down to redeem, redeem SB. Now, as you can see, you got a lot of different gift cards. You can kind of scroll down here. Um, my favorite is 
$5 PayPal cash. So you're going to click on $5 PayPal and you're just going to click on claim gift card. Now it gives me a message saying I need 162 more SP to redeem this reward. But I just wanted to show you, you know, I'm not up to, I obviously have 338 swag bucks at this point. Normally, as soon as I get 500, I can come down here and I'm going to click on claim gift card. So hopefully that gives you an idea of how to claim your rewards. Um, there's a lot of other rewards on here. You know, they all list the amount of swag bucks it takes to get the reward. Um, I always come down. I always do PayPal. I mean, I'm doing it to make cash for myself. So, I mean, you can do whatever you want to do. I mean, there's, you know, you name it, they have a, they have a gift card for it. I mean, you can scroll through and they have, you know, countless gift cards from different companies. Um... And if I click on view all, you know, I can scroll down. You'll see that you can get gift cards from Best Buy. Uh, you know, you name it, you name it. It just keeps going on and on as far as gift cards you can get from different places. So if that's, if that's why you're using it to try to get gift cards, you can get a Visa gift card. Um, of course, the amount of money it'll cost to get the gift card is listed underneath. So anyways... Just wanted to show you how to redeem your rewards when you're ready to do that. Um, every time you want to go back to the main page, you're just going to click on the big swag, swag book thing on the left. Now, a few other ways I love to earn. I'm going to go down to... Actually, this is one of my favorite ways to earn. So once again, I'm going to go back to search. I'm going to type in coupons. Dot com. I'm going to come down here, print coupons. It's going to tell me I can earn one SB for every coupon printed. and 25 swag bucks for every coupon I redeem. So I'm gonna click on this. Now it's gonna show you all the coupons that you have. They're free printable coupons. Now you have to do this through the swag bucks search in order to be getting credit for these coupons on Swagbucks. So make sure you use the Swagbucks search when you're typing in that coupons.com. You know, you got their your little search bar right here on Swagbucks itself. So here, you're just gonna scroll down. And here's what you're going to do. Um, so you're going to Scroll down here. This is the easiest way to do it. You're going to select Clip All right here on the bottom of the screen. This shows me I got 102 coupons I can print. Now I'm not going to 
Well, you know, I will I will proceed with printing the coupons themselves, so. Actually, in the essence of saving time, I'm not actually going to print out the coupons right now, but basically it's pretty self-explanatory. You're going to print the coupons. Remember, I clipped 102. Your limit is 50 swag bucks per day. So um, basically you're going to want to make sure that you I got 102 selected. What I want to do is get get it down to 50 because you can only clip 50 a day. So I'm going to go through this process. I'm clipping a lot of them. I got one of these touch screens, just use your mouse otherwise. It's usually a fairly fast process. Um, I like to make sure I'm gonna get credit for all the coupons I print, so that's why I'm, I like to get credit for coupons every day and you only get, you only get credit for printing 50 a day. Um, as I explained before, you will get you get 50 swag bucks a day or 50 cents per day for printing these coupons. But for every one that you use at the grocery store, you will get 25 cents or 25 SB added to your account for each one you actually use. So that's where the money with printing these coupons really adds up. Um, I'm going to show you a little trick here soon. Uh, that will get you some, if you hate using coupons, you can still print the coupons every day. Um, and you don't actually have to, I'll show you in a second, but I just want to get down to the 50. Let's see where we're at. So I've unclipped an appropriate amount of coupons. Now I got 50 coupons ready to print. So I'm going to click on print coupons. Next step, you're gonna have to verify your phone number. I'm not gonna show you what my phone number is, but um, just wanna give you an example of how it works. As you can see, my coupons are now printing. I verified my phone number. And I'm going to suggest. I'm going to say I'm just going to print to PDF. Um, basically, I'm not interested in printing out the coupons on my printer right now. I'm just going to basically save them as a PDF on my computer. And like I said, this is the kind of little trick. If you don't ever intend to use the coupons, 
save them as a PDF on your computer. You're gonna get 50 cents per day credit to your account just for saving the coupons onto your hard drive right onto the main part of your computer and then throw them in your trash, delete the coupons. You still get 50 cents a day if you don't ever intend to use them. However, I personally use them. You can't believe how much you know the money adds up when you're getting 25 cents per coupon that you use. Uh, it's, it's really great, so um, anyways. I'm gonna save these coupons on my hard drive and I won't, I'm sure you can figure out how to do that yourself, but. Um, Anyways, we're back, we're back to my demo. Um, so I showed you how to print coupons. They printed successfully. Basically, you're gonna get 50 cents credited. Well, I will. Um, it'll come on the next business day. The, any ones that you use at the grocery store, you're gonna get 25 cents for every coupon that you use. However, that takes 15 days to be credited to your account, so don't expect them the next day. You'll see the 50 cents credited for the print, or like I showed you, you can save as a PDF, but you will not get the credit for using the coupons at the grocery store until 15 days after you use them. So don't expect the money to hit your account right away. Um, that's the same thing for what I showed you earlier with uh, using the swag button to get cash back where you shop online. That will take a while to get credit back to your account, approximately 15 days to get credited back. Printing coupons is one thing that gets credited the next day. So once again, we're done with that activity. We're gonna go back to the main site. Um, show you a few other of my favorite ways to make money on here. Um, I'm gonna go down to something pretty fun. So look at the left side of your screen here. You got a bunch of tabs. Uh, you're gonna go down to what's going on with promotions. Right now, we got a team challenge going on. Um, team challenges are pretty fun. Basically, you can, you can join a team challenge. Uh, anytime you see one, it's gonna be on the left side of your screen. You know, one's going on right now. And so far, I've only contributed 15 points to my team, but the, the uh, just started, this team challenge just started. So, um, something kind of cool to do. Basically, you get assigned to a team. There's these four different teams right now. Um, if you contribute a certain amount of points to your team, you're gonna get uh, 100 swag bucks sent to your account. The way you earn these points is by doing these different activities. Basically earning, when you earn money on the site, which I'm kind of walking you through how to do, you'll contribute points to your team and eventually that's how you're gonna make some money on the site. So, sorry this thing is so long, but I'm trying to give you my favorite ways to make money on the site. Uh, you can do all the things I'm showing you in about five minutes. I'm just being long-winded in how I'm explaining everything, and I, I apologize for that, but I wanna make sure I run you through everything. Here's another promotion. Uh, basically, it's called Swaggo. It's basically like bingo. You're doing different things. You're earning money on Swagbucks 
by doing different things on here, you kind of, you fill up your board and you can, you know, bingo, you go all across the line, you earn, you know, uh, you do the whole perimeter, you get 105, you fill up this whole board, you're going to get 500 swag bucks, which is the equivalent of $5, so, which you can cash out on PayPal. So playing these games is pretty fun. Right now we got Swaggo and a team challenge over here. So like I said, anytime you want to go back to your main page, just click on the swag box in the far left hand side. Um, so anyways, I am going to show you another thing I like to do on swag box. It's called watch. You're going to click on watch. You got these videos, pretty self-explanatory. You're going to click on these different videos and you watch them on your screen. Um, my favorite ones, you pay attention to how many steps it takes to earn. You basically got, in this one, you click on financial news, you got three steps to earn two swag bucks. Um, now, there's a couple of them that say three steps. You know, you got daily sports, three steps. The ones that do not tell you, uh, basically this row is my favorite. Um, if you only have a few minutes to do these, do financial news because it's three steps, daily sports content, um, and lifestyle, and your financial news. Those three are going to be three steps, and those are going to be the quickest way for you to watch a couple of videos and earn a couple, couple swag bucks per video that you watch. You got a whole list of videos you can watch here, and I mean the. I guess I, I could say go through these, you can go through these pretty quickly. The interesting thing is you have a app, a Swagbucks app, which I definitely recommend. I'm showing you everything on the website. You download the Swagbucks app on your phone. There's also a section on the Swagbucks app, which the app is much easier to go through. Basically, the, the biggest thing that I do on my app, I don't really do anything else. I watch videos on the app. You can leave that app going 24 hours a day. You don't even have to interact with it. The difference, the website, you actually, you know, you would have to click on the video and then you're going to click on discover content and you're going to sit here and you see the time ticking away there. You actually have to, once that time ticks away, you actually have to proceed to the next video. Now, the biggest difference... I'm not even going to bother doing it now, but, um, you know, you're on step one of three. You got to basically come down as soon as you hit, as soon as this 25 seconds has elapsed, you watch the video and then you got to click continue watching when you're doing on the website. Now, I'm going to just click out of here for now. I'm trying to run this, get you through this. So you're probably already bored, but, um, anyways, Watch, watch on the website. Definitely download, download the app on your phone. Cool thing about watching videos on the phone, you click watch, you leave your phone in a different room, plug it into charge, whatever you wanna do. Those videos can literally run 24 hours a day. Uh, I would say every once in a while, you might need to hit continue, but you can literally let it run for at least an hour at a time. You don't have to pay attention to it like these. Here you gotta interact with the videos click continue after each video that you watch to earn your money. When you do it on the, when you do it on your phone, you let those videos go all the time. You don't even need to pay attention to the phone. So that's kind of cool. Um, so I've showed you a couple of my favorite ways to make money on here. Um, there's obviously a lot of other things that you can do on here. I mean, um, you can go to the left side of the screen I'm gonna show you one one more way that you can make money on here, which is pretty popular. Um, you're gonna come over here once again, click on this big swag bucks button here, gets you back to the main screen, uh, and you're gonna click on answer. Um, some people like to spend a lot of time answering surveys. Uh, you know, you got you got a lot of surveys here that you can answer. There's literally um, hundreds and hundreds of surveys you can do, maybe even thousands. I, there's no way you could get through all these surveys in a single day. Some of them pay out really big. 
Uh, if I'm being honest about it, I actually like to stay to the short surveys that pay not necessarily how much I, I want to take a survey that takes less time. So you see some of these are seven minutes. Uh, let's see what else we got here. I mean, we got some that are five minutes. To me, time is money, so I like to stick to the shorter length surveys. Other cool thing about it, every survey that you attempt on here, whether you finish it or not, um, you're just gonna click on start survey to take the survey. They could be about various things. Usually it's something interesting like music that you like, uh, maybe video games that you play, you name it. They, do, they You don't really know what the survey is gonna be um, until you click on it, but like I said, I stick to the shorter length surveys. Um, some of them have this guaranteed, which means you're going to get this, you're going to get the swag bucks no matter what. Um, other ones, anyone that does not say guaranteed on there, it, you may or may not qualify. Don't, don't worry if you don't qualify. There's literally thousands of surveys you can attempt to take. The other cool thing is you start a survey, you're going to get some credit for it. Minimum of a single swag buck. If you answer some demographic questions like your age and you don't match up with what they're looking for. Maybe they're looking for somebody who's 50 years and above and you're only 25 years old. You just be honest about how old you are and you, eventually a survey will hit that you'll qualify for. But anyways, if you answer the, a few of the introductory questions and you do not qualify for the survey, you will still get anywhere between one and 10 swag bucks added to your account just for a survey attempt. So, you know, it doesn't hurt to attempt a bunch of surveys every day. You're still going to get some money added to your account. But I'm going to be honest, I don't spend that much money with the surveys. Um, my biggest thing is I'm just going to go. I, the biggest way I earn money on the site is when I search for hotels on Priceline or, you know, uh, if I go to Walmart.com or if I go to Amazon.com and buy something. The first thing that I showed you is how, how to get that, um, you know, swag button added to your account. I'm going to get cash. I'm going to get swag bucks added to my account. I mean, I've gotten, I, I went to Medieval Times, which is like a dinner place. Um, and they gave me, that was a really good deal. I mean, I got basically half the money back from that dinner that I went to at Medieval Times. I think it was like, you know maybe a $30 dinner and I got 1500 um, you know, I got basically $15 worth of swag bucks, which is 1500 swag bucks back, um, kind of like cash back. And of course I can cash that out for a $15 gift card. So biggest way is shop on here to earn money. Um, if you don't shop a lot, of course you can, mess around with watch. Um, there's also, you know, there's a lot of different ways you can earn. Be besides what I showed you, I showed you a few of my favorite ways to earn. Um, but you can also just play play with all these things. I mean, there's Discover. Um, 